Hi, I'm Eric Fall with Universal Nissan. This is my partner, Pablo. Today, we're going to show you how to replace a battery. Right, so right now, we're, what uh, my partner is doing is he's attaching the Nissan certified battery tester just to uh, keep record about like how or and why the battery had failed. So right now he's walking towards the doors to uh, get the barcode of the vehicle. Now he's taking uh, the heat temperature because the heat does affect the battery. Especially in Florida, it does tend to weaken the battery overall. Now the system's doing a battery test to make sure everything uh, is either good or bad. So since the battery did fail, we're now we're gonna replace it. What we also like to do is have, leave the car running so that way the alternator is powering everything and that way the customer's uh, presets like the radio and all that doesn't uh, go away. So right now what, you wanted, what he's doing is disconnecting the negative cable so that way it doesn't uh, do an, an arc and the proper way is to take off the batteries the negative first then the positive and you always want to cover up the, neg the negative uh, terminal so that way it doesn't uh, short out and uh, kill the car Now we're putting in the new battery. When, every time when you put in the new battery, we'd always want to do the positive terminal first, then the negative. Then once both of those are tightened down, we like to shut off the vehicle so that way it doesn't kill the car or anything like that. Once everything's bolted down, we just like to double check, make sure everything's all tightened up. And if things uh, do become loose, they will wear down the battery a little bit quicker and cause some issues. So once everything's tied down, what we like to do is get the battery tester and we would uh, do a system check. To make sure everything's functioning properly from the alternator to the battery to the starter. Starting the system test would be similar to starting the battery test. He would open up the door and grab the barcode. Then now he would also take a picture of it again. And now with the system test, you need the car running. The battery has loaded up. The battery has loaded up. What it tells us to do is start up the vehicle. So that way it shows you, shows the, vo the voltage going to the starter. Then it's asking us to, to make sure that everything is off, like the high, the high beams and the blower motor. Now the, it's testing the alternate at idle. Now we're gonna be do, uh, testing the engine at 2000 to 3000 RPM. That's the time where you're usually in range driving around town, all right? So now uh, we return back to idle. Now we return on the high beams and the blower motor. This causes more uh, voltage to go through the alternator. It's testing at, uh, at idle again. Now it's revving, it's telling us to rev the engine between 2000 and 3000 RPM. All right, so now we just turn off everything and we shut off the vehicle. So now that's what the results we get from a good battery. So once that's done, we just hit send results and we print it out. And we staple it to the work order. Now it prints out from here and it shows all the details from the battery. All right, so like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Again, this is Eric and this is my partner Pablo. And just give us a thumbs up.